Hopefully you guys enjoy this as much as I did for being for being such an awkward game. It was just fun. Also, uh, one of the developers of this game got on bang I mean, banging music. Yeah, the music for this game was fantastic. The music for this game was so good that for such a bad game, Sega felt the need to repurpose it, They felt the need to repurpose multiple songs from this game into Sonic Adventure 1. We're just gonna start. My bad. <laughs> Flickies are mysterious birds. They live in another dimension and can travel anywhere through large rings. Oh, I forgot how slow this cut these this opening cutscene is. Robotnik learns about the Flickies. Change the Flickies into robots and have them search for the Chaos Emeralds for me. Using the infinite power of the emeralds, I can conquer the world! Oh, that's, that's a hard voice on my throat. I forgot. Sonic visits Flicky Island to see his friends, but the only thing he finds are robots. Man, look at them animations. <laughs> They're crispy. 4K version of this? I can't help you there. Oh no, is my controller wire starting to get loose? Robotnik made my friends like this. I must save them. Robotnik must be stopped. Sonic starts to defeat the enemies in order to rescue the Flickies who are trapped inside. Man, look at those cutscenes. I forgot. Go, Sonic. You can warp through the big rings with the help of the Flickies. Chase after Robotnik and defeat his plans. straight a homing attack. You don't even have to be right below them. Ooh, this control scheme is awkward. So, max points. Down to the next area. Also, funny enough, this first stage, the music is so long compared to how long the stage is that you never hear the whole thing. This First stage is music loops around like two and a half minutes, and you just never hear it. You need more flickies to get that. Flickies increase. 
increase that down point. What was the what was the level this was reused for? Windy Hill Zone, right? The Sonic Adventure one? Uh the Panic Puppet was Yeah, Panic Puppet was reused for Twinkle Park. I own that game too, actually. Oh hello! Yeah, that's right. The pattern makes your eyes hurt. We'll get used to it, because that's exactly what happens. Are you serious? Zero to go. Yeah, the special stage for this one is just... I mean, it's, it's very much Sonic 2, just on a different perspective, and it's weird. With not as great music. I already have 150, I could just not get hit, not collect a single item. Literally the exact same style, you just on a different perspective. In a way, that's not very inventive, is it? Okay. Oh, he's an all 160 some? Oh no, that's right. Took me back to the first part of the stage. Ugh. Even worse. Back. Get that back. And yeah, the pattern makes your eyes hurt. Now. Sorry, but that's just the way it's kind of designed. I got a question for people, by the way. Anybody out there familiar with the game Shadow Man? Anybody at all? Shadow Man? Yeah, Shadow Man. It was a Nintendo 64 game that was re- uh, it was rebooted and uh, relaunched on Steam. Sorry, not rebooted. It was remastered and put on Steam. It was actually a really good game on Steam. They added a lot more... They added a lot more stuff. The company you work for did the remaster? Are you... You're, you're trolling, right? Tell me you're trolling. Because I have actually been wanting to play that damn game. I just need a good excuse to buy it. And if people are really interested in seeing it, I would... That's... That's, that's crazy, dude. That... <laughs> dude. <laughs> I was a fan of that game before the remaster. I was so shocked when I saw that that game was uh, remastered with all the cut content. Multiple animations, new... Multiple animations, new uh, stages and enemies and stuff like that. great to hear that uh, that that series is getting love that it original artists oh absolutely I would include the original artists like that would be amazing to work on there on the this game's so awkward to control I feel like I'm constantly like moving and jittering and it's just not it doesn't feel good 
Mine just switched back to Sonic. Sonic 3 and Knuckles faster than magic. Okay. There's Knuckles. Give me this Sonic stage. Comic, not movie. Yeah, I, I think you're right, but. The fact that the, that game got love is just, it makes, it, it puts a warm feeling in my heart. That game was really weird and interesting. It was just delightfully gruesome and occult. It deserved a lot more attention than it got. And, um, for being one of the few, like, really hard M-rated Nintendo 64 games, it was great. In a way, it felt a little inspired by Legend of Zelda and a few other, like, collectathon style things, but in its own way, it just felt really interesting. I I'm considering picking it up in fact, I'm probably just going to pick it up at that price and play it later. Leisure Suit Larry, I don't think that's allowed to be played. Eh, I don't think it's allowed to be played on Twitch. I don't think any of them are, actually. Just, just so you know, like, if I pick it up, you're, you're going to have to get a private stream for me. The amount of work that you had to do to get any kind of thing edited is just not worth it. Um, and then the rest of them just feel like they... Looks 
crispy. FromSoft. Oh shit, that's like, oh, I remember, that's classic FromSoft. I forgot all about that. Yeah.
any fucking spinners. say, hey, I can do this. Let me be part of your group. Let me do something. And I can contribute in a meaningful way, rather than just being like, I've got ideas. Ideas don't get you. I learned that a long time. So, but unfortunately, you have to develop some of those skills from an earlier age, and I'm starting to get better. So, funny as it is, This boss, and then I'll just go ahead and change to Sonic the Red Knuckles. It's getting a little bit late. It's only 11 o'clock, though. But that gives me plenty of time to get through a big chunk of Sonic. Sonic 3 Knuckles. I'm also sadly starting to run low on bourbon, so. Not that that's gonna put a damper on the night, but it's just a. Uh, just a status update for people. <laughs> It wasn't, trust me, I'm not a, an absolute drunker, just kind of a slight drunker. And again, for people that know me, being former military, current chef, not actually even a chef. Oh wow, that's the edge of the, that's the great gold ring already?
Hurry, hurry, get over here. Is he really running the fuck away from me? I see you over there, flame shield. You can't escape my eye. Yeah, no, I, I remember this. This stuff was my childhood. I actually never owned this one personally until much later in life, but it was still very fun. boss and then I'll call it. I'll just uh, move on to Sonic 3 and Knuckles. This is... This... Like, this is not the worst game that I've ever played. That's kind of the funny part. At least the music is good. Better than some things that I could say.
No, I, I didn't cheat it the first time. I actually played it pretty legitimately. And you talk about... You talk about frustrating. Why didn't I do that the first time? boss is actually cool. Like, the first one's like, alright, cool. It's like, basic, hey, introduction to boss. Babby's first boss, one-on-one. It kind of explains, like, oh, this is how it's supposed to be. plus an angle in order to achieve the direction he's that you are trying to push. This this stage is fun, but 
it's already going on 11, 12. If I want to hit Sonic and uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, I got to start now. So I'm going to just go to me. I'm going to take me to an AFK.